Coach was saying that you guys had some lively practices this week. What was the, what did you get out of those practices and what was you know, coming at this game that had a response from the next game? I think it was a lot about rededicating ourselves, you know, back to the game and back to defense. I think um, Sunday's performance was a very embarrassing you know, performance, you know, getting blown out like that. And um, we're usually known for being a good defensive team. And to give up that many points was unacceptable for this team. So I think we had to rede rededicate ourselves to defense. And we also worked on being a little bit sharper on offense. Um, we weren't moving the ball as well as we could. And we missed a lot of guys in the previous game. So we just, you know, worked on being sharper on offense and, you know, making sure our defense was where it's supposed to be. Uh, for either of you guys, do you think coming into the season there was sort of more of a pressure on you guys or because of the ranking and because of coming off the tournament appearance, sort of a different feeling or more pressure and that led to sort of the, uh, the performance over the last five games? Uh, I don't think it was a pressure from us per se, but of course, you know, we had a lot to live up to from last year from making the tournament and everything. And so, you know, everybody's next thing was what's next. So we had a lot of, you know, outside pressure, but I felt like we did a good job not feeding into that that much. It's just I feel like we had a lot of bad habits that we picked up throughout the year, throughout the summer that, you know, these last couple of days we had to break and we had to build new habits and basically get back to what got us there last year. Uh, you guys, as well as uh, Vic and Gavin, were all in double figures tonight. Uh, when you all are spreading the wealth around on offense, what does that do for the team as a whole? I think it lifts everyone up. Um, I think this team has a lot of weapons, and when everyone's firing on on all all cylinders, I think you know we're a pretty hard team to beat. Uh, Derek, it seemed like early on you were uh, sort of <coughs> clogged up in the inside, but then you started to get more space, especially like towards the end of the first half. Uh, what was the scheme offensively, and how did you find a rhythm? A rhythm? Uh, well, they went to the, went the zone later on in the second half, I mean the first half. So I just try to get lost, stay underneath. You know, our guards do a good job of, you know, finding me when I'm, when I'm lost in there behind the defense. So I just try to stay lost and uh, get stuff at the rim. You know, Scott drove him there a couple times, got me a couple dunks, you know. That builds, builds my confidence up a lot too. So I just try to, you know, do my best. Scotty, you talked about defense before. Can you just talk about the defense in the second half, holding them to 19 points and 33% shooting? Yeah, our defense in the second half for pretty much every game this year has been awful. And um, we held them to 31 points in the first half, which is OK. But we, you know, we really had an emphasis on you know, trying to keep them under that. And uh, I think we came out from the start playing really good defense and uh, you know, had a hand up on shooters. You know, we rebounded well. But it's, it's been something that we've been working on and something that we've been harping on for the whole season is our second half defense. And I think we play really well defense tonight. What was the mood following Sunday's loss? And how did you guys refocus to, uh, to better prepare for this game today? Well, the overall mood, I would say, was a lot of disappointment, um, embarrassment, and the sense that we had to get back to work. Um, and throughout this whole week, we got, we got back to work. and. Rededicated ourselves, and you know I think today was a, a good step forward. You know on you know building you know something better. I think this was a fresh start for us, and uh, hopefully we keep up the good play. Um, Scotty, um, Coach Pons was talking about one of the point of this for you guys trying to get you in the post more in different places. What do you, what's your goal coming into game off in, from an offensive perspective? Well, I know this team. You know. <clears throat> It depends on me to, you know, put the ball in the hoop. Um, you know, I can shoot threes or whatever, but I think the team needs me to get in the lane and create for others also and get to the line and, and score on posts. You know, I'm usually taller than the people that are guarding me, and they want me to take, you know, advantage of the people that are smaller than me and, you know, score in the post. Uh, for Derek, uh, the team has really featured you more on the block so far this season uh, through six games. How has that adjustment been for you, and uh, what are you looking to do there on the block? Uh, I'm just looking to be a presence, uh, to know that when they throw the ball down the block, me that I can make smart decisions with it, whether that's scoring or passing and uh, creating shots for my teammates. I just, early in the early in the games, I've just been trying to, you know, slow myself down. I've been speeding myself up a lot lately, so just better take my time and make good decisions with the ball.